talks about internet and introduction to understand the term internet first of all we will discuss about network to understand network we will discuss two examples the first example is of roads by roads we can travel from one place to another if we want to go from one place to another then we can use roads this means we all are connected to each other by road we, if we want to go to our friends home or relatives place so definitely by roads either by driving by walking or okay by riding a bike we can visit at the place so this means we all are connected how by using a network that is called road network so using the road network we can visit from okay we can travel from one place to another and we can transfer transports also the goods from one place to another the second type of network that we will discuss is telephone network or we can say nowadays since we are using mobile so we can say mobile network we all are connected with each other by mobiles if we want to have communication with our friends relatives or if you want to send any message okay uh, then definitely we can instantly send it or we can say immediately send it okay by using mobile phone network and all the mobiles are connected okay whenever we are making want to make a call to any of the mobile we can have to simply dial the number and call on that number and of okay we can call that person and we can get in touch with that person or friend or relative okay to whom soever we are calling so this means we are connected again that makes what that connectivity with all that makes a network network of mobile phones or we can say network of telephones now all of you have got an idea of a network now by looking at this picture you will be able to get an idea that what it makes you can see here in this picture there are computers or you can see the laptops okay they are computers so when computers are connected to each other that makes computer network now why we want to connect computers okay to make a network why we want to make a network of computers or we can say why we want to connect two computers or two or more computers the question is why why we want to connect the answer to this question is to share but what what to share we want to share the information using computers okay by connecting two or more computers what we want to share we want to share information by connecting two or more computers that information may be in the form of text that is words letters or sentences in the form of graphics or we can say pictures in the form of audio or we can say voice or in the form of video now you will be able to understand what is internet when millions of computer or we can say when large number of computers around the world or globe are connected to each other to share information that is known as internet and we have discussed what is the information that is to be shared in the next upcoming topics okay or in the next video we will discuss the basic terminologies or we can say basic terms that are related to internet 
the first term is web browser the second one is website and third one is web page and next is home page and last one is search engines so first of all we will discuss these terms then we will discuss the uses of internet advantages and disadvantages and the remaining topics of the lesson